just went to press print and realised that it was set on the ET 2710. I don't know why this week I realised when I said this in the vlog I was like 2710. That doesn't make sense, it's the 2710! Anyway, it's still set to print on the Series 2 sublimation printer. That is no more. Well, it is here. It's here. It's here. But it's no more. And here we go. I'm the founder of Premier World Company. I make whimsical, illustrated art prints and gifts. And I'm here in the studio today. It's the weekend. I've actually forgot to put the light on, which I'll do. The studio is a little bit messy, so we do need to do a bit of tidying at some point. But I have just finished printing. Hold on, let me get the camera to focus. The latest, or one of the latest, Floral art prints I created a little reel, popped it up on Instagram and YouTube. If you're not already following, make sure you check me out at Frame Your World Co. I'll pop the link on the side here. And yeah, that's what I've been doing so far. Now I have to focus. I'm going to work on printing with the new Sawgrass SG500. I got it last week. I talked about it in the vlog. And now I need to make sure I am... Printing, getting ready for Christmas season, which is right around the corner. Well, that's better. I'm about to get on with watching some videos to learn how to use the Sawgrass 500, SG500. By the way, if you were here last week, I accidentally, well, kept referring to the EcoTank 2710 as a 2710 printer. I even questioned myself there, did you see that? And it's, yeah, 2710 Eco Tank printer, not 2710. <laughs> um. All set up and ready to go. The sawgrass is connected, but I'm just trying to decide what to test print first. I do have a selection of sublimation items to use that I've had for a while. We've got this ceramic coaster and I've also got a ceramic tile that I'm planning to turn into Christmas bubbles. So I'm really excited to see these come to life. I have some Christmas designs that I might try or we might just look for something, something different, maybe awesome. We'll have a think. This um, setting up the sublimation printer, it's taken a little longer than I um, planned for. I gave it like half an hour on my planner. My, uh, what's it called again? Action Panda, Panda Action. Anyway, shout out to Beth who recommended the planner that I'm using. But yeah, this is taking a wee bit longer than I am um, probably allotted for. But that's okay. Hot drink first. Said I had to do a firmware update. This this looks good. Using the Sawgrass Print Utility Creator Studio function to print, and I thought I'd start with a couple of designs. We've got a new one, which is the rose. We've got a little interpretation of the magical castle. We've also got Florence. This is back to front, but actually, oh yeah, because I mirrored it. <laughs> this is our um, Winnie the Pooh coat. 
And then we've got Bruno, the Highland Q, and we've also got the pumpkins here. Now, I probably need to fix this design if I was going to take it to the market, but I really like it and I just want to see what it's like. So yeah, this is what we're printing. Oh, printer's ready. trouble and challenges that I ended up having with the eco tank. I am just so chuffed that I can finally, finally print, print and actually not have to outsource anything. I can print from in-house. So definitely going to be experimenting more with the design. plan is that tomorrow we will um, bring some additional shelving and hopefully I'll get some products in. I'm planning to bring back the fairy lights because I'm missing a little bit of them um, sparkle and also pop up the shelf that we got. I asked on Instagram this week if um, for some help with placing the shelf that we got from B&Q. So, we're going to be putting that up hopefully tomorrow and then I'll show you what it looks like once we're done. First of all, I just want to say thank you if you're new here, if you've come back and you've watched any of my recent vlogs, I really appreciate you. If you could do me the biggest favour, please do a like and subscribe. Click on the bell notification so you're notified when I next drop a video. I'm uploading little short vlogs every Thursday, so yeah. I hope you can join. I'm doing lots of behind the scenes and tips and lots more plans to come. All right then, I need to go and get dinner. I'll see you guys next week in the vlog for another studio update.